Hi, Brooke here with Philips Fiber Art. Today I'm going to show you the ruby ring. This is one of our jewel box patterns using the Gem 5 and 10 tools. This is our sample we're going to be making today. Oh, isn't it cool? I love it. So, let's take a look. Let's grab our Gem 5 and 10 tools. Let's start with the Gem 5 and we're going to cut one piece out of this cream fabric. Cut all the way around the tool. Don't forget those little notches. Now let's add on our second piece. Align it like so, right sides together. Sew it, open it up, and now we trim it. Just trim it here, and we're going to add on piece number three. This one is our striped fabric. It adds that whole cool element to it. Lay it on, sew it, open it up. Now we need to trim it again. So grab your gem 10, and we're going to align it. Really pay attention here, because this is what's going to make it so that it lines up right to the center. So let's make our pentagon. So we've got these three pieces. Now I need to cut the other ones. So this one's going to use the strip set that we build. And I'm going to cut the gem five. And I'm going to cut it so that I have two mirror images. So here's piece one. And here's piece two, putting the tool on in the opposite direction. All right, check it out, we got two pieces. Stripe goes on each side. Now I'm going to lay out my pentagon using those first three pieces and the two pieces I just cut. Sew them together like you see in the pentagon video. And here's our finished pentagon. You can see from the back that how we've ironed it and sewn it together. Alright, let's continue on. So we need some tens. These ones we're going to use a partial tool. The line is on the tool and you can find out what that is in the pattern. So I'm going to cut two of these. And they fit right on the bottom of my pentagon. Sew those on. Now we're going to add our border. Yep, that's a built-in border right there. So I like to find the center, fold it in half. You can make sure it aligns to the center of your pentagon. Sew that on there, open it up. And there we go. Now we need to trim that off so we get that nice, perfect triangle. Now, back to that first piece that we sewed together, we need to add it on. So, check out the top of your piece, and we're going to align the other piece to the top. Match those seams so that it ends up perfectly. You can nest them real nice. Sew it along there, open it up, and this is what you have. Open up that seam, it makes it lie just a little flatter. And we're going to make one that direction and one the opposite direction. 
You can see how when you make them opposite, that comes together to that nice star. So what'd you think? That was a good project, wasn't it? That is the Ruby Ring, and it uses the Gem 5 and 10. So visit us at philipsfiberart.com for this product and much more. Hope to see you there.